José Isaías. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Pretty good. A little tired, but hey, it's okay. It's oh, we almost finished, right? Yes. Tomorrow is Tuesday. Exactly. The week is only the class tomorrow, and then we relax. Yes. And Jose, at what time do you wake up? I wake up at uh, 6 a.m. Okay. And what time do you begin working? I begin work, work at 8 p.m. 8 a.m. Sorry. Okay. Okay. It's not too bad, huh? From you start at eight, at eight a.m. You finish what? Five p.m. No, six p.m. Six p.m. Okay. Yes. But you don't work Saturday. Uh, exactly. Um, I imagine. Mm -hmm. It's better. It's, for me, I prefer work one more hour and not work Saturday. Yes, the Saturday is free. Uh-huh, it's better. But some people know they finish at five, but they have to go to work on Saturday. Yes. And what do you do on the weekends, Jose? Uh, well, this is my family and go out with my friends. Okay. All right. Uh, Karen, how are you? Good evening. Good evening. I am fine. Thank you, teacher. I'm you? I'm doing good. Hey, Karen, what time do you wake up? What? What time do you wake up? Uh... I, maybe uh, five, um, 13? No, uh, see, 15. 515. Yes. Uh, I know, I don't remember, 15? 15, yes, 515. 15, ah, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a yes. little early, yes. And Yeah, because I, I, I have a, a two child, but no, I have a free child with my husband. <laughs> <laughs> Two or three? <laughs> With my husband, it's three. Okay. And you have more children? No. No, no. Only mm. three children? Yes. Ah, uh-huh. Okay, okay. Because it's typical in, in the... With the men, it's very typical. I have two children with my wife. Uh-huh. And one, and one child before my wife. <laughs> <laughs> no. I know that. <laughs> no. And what is your daily routine, Karen? What? What is your daily routine? Uh, it's, uh, it's all day. Um, I First, I wake up at uh, 5 and 15. And, mm -hmm. and I wake up uh, my child, my husband. And... Sometimes it's like uh, military style <laughs> because I need five the old the old people here mm -hmm. um, for a uh, for uh, get a bath, a bañarse. I don't know how you say. Yes, take a shower. Take a shower. Yes, uh, Andreas and. I make the breakfast, the lunch, uh, for the free, for the three, and, and I then I need to take uh, my child for uh, college, drive to a college mm -hmm. or to a school. To school, exactly. Mm -hmm. And then I I don't know how you say regresar. Return. I return my house for cleaning, for um, for cook, and and sometimes I, I need to go the 
or uh, the other things like uh, uh, I know how you say como mandados, no sé. Good. No, no, no. It's okay. Go, stay in English. It's good. Uh, it's they're called chores. Chores. Mm. Chores are okay. So chores are in the house, in the house, and errands are outside the house. For example, go to the supermarket, go to the bank outside the house is errands. In the house, cook, clean, wash the dishes, the laundry is chores. Ah, okay. Errands is it out. Out. Errand. Errands out. Out of the house. Chores is 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 Inside. in. Huh? Correct. Oh, Inside. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and the um, then I uh, is it uh, twelve <laughs> in the uh, at mediodía at noon at noon mm -hmm. 12 at noon and then I need to cook for the lunch um, how, I don't know how you say lunch and breakfast lunch and breakfast brunch mm -hmm. no 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 uh, uh, in the morning uh, I prepare the breakfast correct in the 12th, I prepare the lunch. Correct. Is a, is a lunch is an almuerzo. Correct. Okay. It's correct. So, yeah. <laughs> uh -huh, so my, my, and then I take for my child, for it, uh, in returning to my house, for it, the old people. And then I, I drive for their activities. Gymnastic, and boxing, and all day I see uh, pay, uh, all day stay stay dry mm -hmm. sometimes, and then I return uh, six thirty p.m. for the cook dinner. Wow, Karen. You... Uh -huh. and, mm -hmm. Uh -huh. and then uh, and then um and then uh, other style military for the old people <laughs> to go to go to bed or to go to sleep yes and and mm -hmm. then the night uh, i connect with you and then uh, like a uh, 10 ferry i I start uh, study for the uh, since university because uh, in, in I am um, I teaching in the university and, and so I need to prepare my classes. So, uh, but this is is only one twice only only one in this in in week. Because oh. it's in linear. Online. Yes. Online. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I need to prepare the uh, material for, for platform. Yes, for the platform. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And, and yes, and then like uh, 12, uh, 11, very sleep. Wow, Karen, it's very, very busy schedule. You have a lot of activities in the day. I'm glad yes. you are very organized. Okay. Well, thank you to everyone for connecting. I see we have a lot of people today, which is excellent. Uh, today, we're going to be finishing unit three, and we're going to be doing a little bit of speaking and some reading. Uh, the topic for today is customs, okay? This is going to be our topic for the reading, the first one. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look. Do you know what are customs? Do you know the meaning of this word, customs? No? Nobody knows customs? Yes, teacher, the phrases. Ah, no, those are for Halloween. They're costumes. 
costumes. Customs are traditions. Here are customs with you. Costumbres únicas no sería. Is with O. I, I'm sorry, what? Please, please repeat. Mm -hmm. Okay, no repeat. Okay. <laughs> All right. So we have costumes that we're going He said that this is a unique costume is a costumbre unica. Correct. These are the yeah, customs. That's right. The the thing... How do you how do you difference the custom with the custom difference? Uh the spelling is different. Do you have the, the customs is with you? And the costumes is with all. Here, let me show you so that you can see. I don't want to put yet. So you see, this one is costumes with O. Normally, people put, they imagine Halloween, right? These are the Halloween ah, okay. costumes. Okay. Mm -hmm. with O, but today we're going to look with U. And you see the position changes, the O and the U. That is going to be the difference. And, and, and for the plural, at the, the E at the end, right? That for the plural, the S is the S. Uh, but in costumes for the phrases is yeah. at, e, at the end, right? It's S, S, that the, the, the normal word is with E. So the, the okay. normal word. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. Good. All right. So first, before we begin our speaking, let's take a look at our reading. Here we have our reading exercise. We have one, two, three, four, five paragraphs. Who would like to read paragraph number one? Please. Me, teacher. Okay. Oh, or Aldini, go ahead. I don't know. Hola, Leo, yo. Yes, go yeah. ahead, Aldini. Go ahead. You read the first paragraph. Yeah, no, go ahead. Seven, six. Uh, Sid Anthony days in Mexico. It's a day when people ask for protection for their animals be Break him then to church. But before the animals go into the church, the people usually dress ten up in flower and ribbon. Okay. Good, Aldini. Thank you very much. For making a good effort. Thank you, Aldini. Who's going to read paragraph number two? Me. Okay. Right now. Okay. Uh, on August 15th of the lunar calendar, Korean celebrates the Shusok, also known as a Korean uh, Thanksgiving. It's a day when people give thanks for the harvest. Korean families honor their ancestors by going to the, their graves to take the rice and fruit and clean the rice, rice sites, right? Grave sites, okay. correct. Grave site, okay. Mm -hmm. Good, who's going to read paragraph number three? Me, teacher. Okay. Long ago in India, a princess who needs help sent her silks, bracelet to an apparel. Also, he did not arrive in time to help her. He kept the bracelet as a scene of the bond between them. Today in India, during, during the festival of Reiki, men promise to be loyal to their women. In exchange, the women give them a bracelet of silk, coral, or gold three. Three? Good, okay. So the pronunciation is bracelet. Bracelet. Correct. And thread. Bracelet. 
Thread. Excuse me, teacher. Thread. Thread. Mm -hmm. Like a C. Like a th the th thread. thread. Mm -hmm. And what did they mean, teacher? Is thread. when you when you make the clothes, you use the thread to make clothes. I don't understand what this means. The clothes, when you make the shirt, yes. the pants, you use thread. You use the thread to make the clothes. The thread is the, the, the string, the string to make it. Okay. Thank you, teacher. This is, I show you. The thread is the string to make the clothes. It's okay. Eh, pues, uh, no es hacer fuerte la ropa. No, es hilo. Look at the picture. Ah. Uh -huh. ah. We entend. Ah. Well, I, I understood that is uh, the the action to do that. <laughs> I don't know, but I, I I know now. The bracelet, the the bracelet, is made of silk, cotton, or gold thread. This is the material they use. Oh, okay, see, yeah. Okay. Good. Who's going to read number four? Me. Okay. One of the biggest celebrations in Argentina is New Year's Eve. On the evening of December 31, families head together and have a big meal at midnight. Fireworks explode, explode everywhere mm -hmm. and continue to go to the throw wood the throughout? night. Mm -hmm. Throughout? Throw out. Mm -hmm. Throw out in the night. E this, this is a day when friends and families meet for parties which last until the next morning. Okay, good. And the last paragraph? Me. Okay. okay. Please read. Mm -hmm. On the evening of February 3rd, People in Japan uh, celebrate the end of the winter and the beginnings of spring. This is known as Setsubun. Family, family members throw drive, been around their homes, uh, shooting, good shouting. Look, shouting, good luck in, evil spirit out. After they throw uh, the beans, uh, they pick them up and eat one bean for each year of their age. Very strange, very strange. Okay. First, any vocabulary, any words you don't know? The... Throws out. Throws out. Throw out. Paragraph four. Paragraph four. Throughout. I'll throw out. Throughout is all the night from the beginning to the end of the night. So the fireworks, no, like in El Salvador. In El Salvador, the fireworks at 12 o'clock. But in Argentina is all the night. Okay. So a uh, throughout is used for all think or, or, or for, for the time, for know. example, it, throughout, time, the, exactly. uh, uh -huh, throughout the class, we speak English is from the beginning to the end. We speak English. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. In, in gray site, what's the meaning? 
it is the cemetery here in the picture is like in the cemetery mm -hmm. in grave are the the, the, the grave is the one the one for one person is the grave um okay 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 The other words are okay? Yes? And what does it mean also uh, in, in the third one, in the third part, paragraph? Uh, although is for opposite ideas. So as an example, that he, he was going to help, she asked for the help, although he did not arrive in time, although he did not help. So is for opposite, is not possible. Okay. I am going, it, it is raining. So although, although it is raining, I am going to go to the beach. Also, is 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 an action you can't uh, do, or uh, for for that. It, the action is for the opposite action, the the not normal. So, for example, oh, okay. Cesar, you are married. Although you are married, you go with another woman to the movies. Uh, yeah, yeah, and I got it now. Okay. Good. Any other words? Throw the beans. Ah, throw the the bean. for five. In okay, so the beans, for example, in El Salvador, for the soup, is the beans, the the vegetable. And then throw is they they put in the hand, and they put it into the garden or into the air. They throw the beans, like the baseball. In the baseball, you throw the ball. But here they throw the beans. It's okay? Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. All right. So now with our partners, now that we read and we understood, now we have to answer all of these questions. We have six of them. And the idea, for example, here, them. Them. What is the meaning? Paragraph one, line two. So in paragraph one, line two, what is the meaning of the I of this? That is what you're going to do with your partner. You're going to answer those questions here. So here is, for example, paragraph one and line two, them. So with your partner, you have to read and select what is the meaning of them? Is it people, animals, or protection? The same for the others, one through six. It's okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so for this activity, let's go with our partners. We have five minutes to try to put what is the meaning for all of them.
Okay, let's take a look at number one. What do you think? What is the meaning? For animals. People. Animals. Okay. What about number two? Oh, uh, shoe sock. Shoe sock. Okay. Number teacher, three. Excuse me, excuse me, teacher. Yes. I, I, I think is um. Excuse me, in Spanish. Pensé que era dentro del contexto de la del párrafo a qué se refería. Correct. And, and so in number one, for me is people. Ah, okay. So for you, number one is people. Ajá, ajá. But but I don't know. No problem. No, no, no. That's the idea. We're going to check. Here we have paragraph number one. And then let me see what we have there. Okay. Ask for protection for their animals by bringing them to church. Okay. So we're going to check if it's in one moment, if it's animals or people, the them. Okay. okay. But for you, you think it's people, correct? Yes, I think. Okay. I think in, in number one, two, I think it's lunar calendar, but. Okay. And you think number two is lunar calendar? No problem. No. no. Okay. This is the idea for reading comprehension. It's okay. It's okay. What about number three? Korean families. Family. Okay. Korean families. Number four. Men. 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 Okay. Number five. New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. Okay. New Year's Eve. And the last one? Beans. Beans. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if we are correct or not. So, yes, number one is animal. They bring them to church. They bring the animals to church. Number two is Chuseok, correct? Number three is the Korean families. Number four was men. And number five, New Year's Eve. And the last one is beans. Okay. Good. Any questions? No. Okay. So that means we are complete. In this moment, we are going to go ahead and have our conversations. Now we're going to talk about traditions uh, and cultural habits, okay? So we're gonna talk about culture. With our partners, we have in the chat, the link for conversations. Okay, and with your partners, we're going to talk about and answer those questions and get more information, talk to our partners. Are we ready? Yes, please. Okay. <laughs> 